Nothing upsets our brave veterans more than an imposter, someone pretending to be someone they're not. One Aurora school board member is now being accused of faking his military accomplishments. The Aurora School Board had been digging into the resume of this man here. This is Eric Nelson after a Denver 7 investigation uncovered that Nelson may have made up portions of his resume. And now since airing that report, our Denver 7 reporter Mark Boyle has found that Nelson may have made up his military honors too. And let me show you why Eric Nelson is being questioned about those military honors. This is a picture that the Colorado Statesman reports he put on Facebook and then took down. You can see these right here. The Air Force tells us these ribbons are all out of order. There are also ranks on his shoulder, and he's wearing a ranking hat. And the Department of Defense told us he only served for two months. Aurora School Board member and Secretary Eric Nelson didn't pick up the phone the first time we called him today. I'm giving you a call because there have been some concerns raised. We called trying to confirm his military service with the Air Force and some of the honors that he's claiming in this picture that the Colorado Statesman reports was posted on Nelson's Facebook page, then later pulled down. Nelson is running for state representative in Aurora's 42nd district and is already under investigation for potentially falsifying other portions of his resume. We showed this picture to World War II veteran Glenn Stinson, who noticed something wrong right away. They're apparently not in the right order, no. And that was confirmed by a retired Marine Corps colonel that we spoke with who served for 27 years. Take a closer look. The Air Force confirms that ribbon is the Defense Superior Service Medal. According to the Air Force, it's often presented to senior officers in the flag and general officer grades. The Department of Defense tells Denver 7 Nelson spent two months in the Air Force at Lackland Air Force Base and ended with the rank of E-2 Airman. Nelson called us back in about an hour and said he wouldn't provide his DD-214 or discharge papers that name his honors earned. Nelson said in a statement, quote, my service record speaks for itself. But the thought of someone making up their military honors has veterans like Glenn Stenson with one thought. It doesn't make us very excited about that type of person that would take advantage of all of those men that served and uh, gave their lives for the country. Email exchange with the Aurora School Board President Amber Drevin tells us that they are looking into his whole resume and wanting proof of some of that. And she says that while these are serious allegations, none of them would require him to actually be kicked off of that school board. We'll, of course, continue to follow this story for you. If you'd like to read part of those comments and part of those statements, they're on our website at thedenverchannel.com. Live in the newsroom, Mark Boyle, Denver 7.